uh, like a cartoon kind of. Uh, uh, it, there's a Chinese uh, saying because Chinese, you know, the face in Chinese is very important. Everybody has face, like uh, in social relationship, it, it, even between different countries. Many many things are, uh, you know, just like ego, oh. face, face, mm -hmm. loose face. Do not you know, very important to to um, concern is your face oh. in front of uh, the society. So this uh, there's a saying say don't uh, you know book can send me a can for me in in face of Buddha. Yeah, that's the it's just a different interpretation. Uh, Buddha face or the monk face. So in Chinese, Buddha face, monk face, no matter who's the re connection, you should help me. That's what kind of Chinese uh, idiom says. Yeah. So uh, everybody try to make uh, a social connection in terms of a Buddha face or monk face. That's, that's literal meaning, but it could be a, a different uh, profession. It can be used in different, just among people. Look in the words the through the speaking. net. That's the description. Yeah, yeah. Just the play of words. Yeah. The net uh, network uh, in the ancient time, it's, uh, there's no internet, uh, but you can still uh, see net. through the yeah the the animal, the little bug uh, here, the spider's net. Uh, it's all the same uh, kind of uh, phenomena if you understand. He needs net. Yeah, human network and the animals network, or the chain, uh, how do you say, life chain. Yeah. All connected. All connected. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's. That's uh, my favorite. I put it in the front of the video I made. Yeah. Pilgrim, uh, that's what I told you yesterday. It's, uh, there's a one kind of monk, they don't live in any temple, they go from one to the other, always on the way uh, by himself. Pilgrim. Mm -hmm. So you're all pilgrims uh, come here. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this is a monk uh, with a bag on his bed. Uh, Traveler uh, with a cane, walking cane. Uh, it says uh, devoted traveling monk. There's kind of monk. They don't stay in any monastery. They travel from one to the other, always on the road. We call it pilgrim monk. That's the pilgrim monk. Can you do the monk? Uh, Just do one stroke, you know, from dry to wet. Back. This is short. Like this. Big. Well, it's not a big back. It's not a big back monk. Single foot. Is this your favorite one, Henry? Yeah. It's beautiful. This is my favorite one. Well, I think the 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 gesture. Is, let me do another one on top. The gesture should be a little linked to the front. I think this, but this is like you know, it's a piece of a rock to start with. This head is a little bent, working on the downward thing. Yeah. My study of this uh, painting, it takes uh, many trials to get this correct. Good though. That's really good. Thank you. That's really nice.
and, and a little further. Right. The top of his cane. Yeah. Oh yeah, close to the cane. So the the, the cane is here. Uh, the jar jar is here. And he become old. Yeah, he's he's very still old. Yeah, he's very old. That hunch, hunch yeah, on hunched, his shoulders. Hunched uh, shoulder. Just, you know, this is not important. What's in your mind is more important. The best picture is always in your mind. So when you paint uh, in front of him, you really look at it. <laughs> okay. That's why I always paint in front of original. In most museums, they don't take, allow you to take pictures, but uh, uh, they, they let you paint. Mm -hmm. So I have a full, several book full of uh, copies of masters from the museum. Wow. Thank you. Bald eagle. Yeah, no, that's an eagle. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so it's uh, yeah, like pr protecting. You can watch the Hondo, Hondo, the Hosan, those are Billy and Jinder. The Billy and Jinder, the Nigga. That's the Nigga, Jerry and Jinder. That's the Nigga. 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 Or uh, open with eyes wide open, <laughs> but uh, the Buddha I uh, or monk I meditative monk always uh, yeah close the eye, so uh, they have different power. Different power. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is uh, the This the the the象征了文德呼同类为仁德 uh, the symbolism, I, I think mostly. There are five symbolisms in, with the uh, rooster. First is uh, the crown, uh, symbolize uh, uh, wonder, means uh, mor uh, morality, uh, or culture, cultivated, cultivated uh, person. You, you, when you have the, the head mm -hmm. of a, a doctor, <laughs> cultivated. Um, the arm, the nail, mm -hmm. uh, symbolize, symbolize yeah, weapon, mm -hmm. and uh, it's a virtue of wu uh, uh, means uh, uh, the opposite of uh, brushwork, the arm, the army, you know, what they call in Chinese uh, like martial arts, uh, that that virtue, that kind of uh, strength, uh, power, power, strength, yeah, mm -hmm. power, and. Uh, uh, the third one is uh, uh, the courage, like fighting spirit. Uh, but they also like to have the benevolence. Uh, when you find a good food, you always, uh, I mean, the, the chicken, I mean, the rooster will call the chicken to join, to share with others. It's a, it's a benevolence uh, virtue. The last one is uh, uh, reliable credibility. Because a uh, rooster I uh, call every every morning. Mm -hmm. Wake you up same time. on time. Yeah, same time. <laughs> same time. Very reliable. Cannot reliable. So uh, everybody that symbolizes a person a uh, good uh, gentlemanship or moral person. So five virtues of a rooster. Yeah.
so credibility, cred, mm -hmm. credit, credibility. We did uh, in the class. Uh, this is the original. So uh, Professor Lu actually did this uh, first, and uh, so I want to do it uh, again here. This uh, chicken head. I think the leg should be a little length so to give it a movement, not straight down. But you don't want to go too detailed, just be very suggestive. I don't have red, so I just outline the comb. This is my Zen rooster <laughs> or chicken, if you will. And, uh, that one is also nice. So, uh, oh, I just leave it out. I like this one. So I only do this. Thanks for watching. So uh, this is again a play of words. In Chinese, the fish pronounces it, but the same pronunciation could also mean the after time, or leisure time, or free time. Free time, I would say. Uh, there are three free, three free times, the winter time in the year, or evening time in the day, or uh, the uh, storm time, or tornado time. When you cannot go to work, those are uh, three times. Like a spare time. Like spare times, yes, yeah, three to spare times, which is very uh, important uh, time for you to utilize, maybe. So, uh, the yu, uh, time, here means the time, not the fish, it's pronounced the same. So, those uh, three times you should be used for uh, reading, a study, a painting. So make it uh, more money for the other time you need to make money. Basically. Yeah, there is a saying says uh, see um, what exactly these people like. Uh, do not uh, consider uh, what they do during the uh, uh, morning. I mean, to uh, from from nine morning to five afternoon. Mm -hmm. See what they what do from uh, after supper from eight to ten. <laughs> so you are what you are, uh, you do in the evening, <laughs> yeah. so to speak. <laughs>
don't be judged by the appearance of people. You don't know. Yeah. Yeah. They could be millionaire. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> they could be. <laughs> so he is a true immortal that has the uh, possess the, uh, the the medicine to heal people. <laughs> okay, I'm going to do this. Uh, I encroach Lee that we did this afternoon in our in our workshop. Uh, he is wearing a very shabby clothes and uh, carrying a big goal with uh, medicine. But most people don't recognize him, just like uh, the goose will treat him as a stranger, uh, a poor um, homeless on the street. So this is the, the theme. He's an ugly, ugly guy with a with medical. This is the very important part, the can. The iron can. Walking can. And the, the goose, of course. This is symbolizes uh, people who judge people by their class, arrogant goose. That's it. Just a quick sketch. See you in class. Goodbye. Now, Gail is looking at my uh, sketchbook of this uh, wonderful show by Professor Lu Mei from uh, Xi'an, China. We only have like a one hour time during a break uh, from our workshop. We're going back to paint. This is very inspirational. That's it. Thank you. How do you think about this show? Oh, it is life changing. It's wonderful. Yeah, this is your second time. Last time we had uh, yeah. uh, the artist, the artist, artist. himself. Uh, this yeah. time you, you have more deep uh, understanding. Yeah, to, to speculate. Yes. <laughs> That's a wonderful experience. I hope you yes. enlightened. Yes. I'm enlightened. <laughs> All the way. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Thank Goodbye. You. Thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks for joining us. See you next time. <laughs>